So recently, Mojang announced that um, uh, Caves and Cliffs would be split into two parts, 1.16 and 1.18. Um, and I called bullshit on this from day one. I was like, what? Uh, I didn't mention this in the video, but I mentioned it in the pinned comment uh, that it doesn't feel like we're getting uh, the split into two parts because we're not getting caves or cliffs in 1.16. Now we're getting both caves and cliffs in 1.18. So, what part of Caves and Cliffs are we really getting? Like, uh, and back then all I really knew uh, was going to be part of Caves and Cliffs were goats and axolotls. Yeah. It's definitely um, screaming, oh yes, th these are vital parts of Caves and Cliffs. Like, um, this is definitely, we're saying that we're splitting the update into two parts for Goats and axolotls. Like there has, there have been more features confirmed to be coming since, but um, uh, like lightning rods, and uh, they did say that bundles, skulkers, which I don't think we're going to be coming in 1.16 or 1.18 because uh, the warden has been uh, delayed outside of the caves and cliffs update, so that's going to get its own update, I guess, or something. Um, and the, um, bundles, candles. Skulkers and bundles, yeah, anyway, um, but as well as uh, goats, glow squids and uh, axolotls, we're going to get also copper and, you know, copper ore and the ores, uh, iron, gold, copper, not dropping uh, their ores when mined, but dropping uh, raw chunks unless you're using silk touch. Um, and um, recent, and I also just like, they're not they're not splitting into two parts, they're just delaying it. They're just delaying Caves and Cliffs, but they didn't want to say that they were delaying Caves and Cliffs because they sort of delayed it already because it was uh, because it was supposed to come out last year. That's what they were saying, but they delayed it into the summer of this year. And now they're essentially delaying it again, but they didn't want to just say they were delaying it for X reason. So, you know, it's basically delayed. They're just half. They basically just don't respect the player base enough to say that it's delayed and, you know, they're just pull, uh, pulling this bullshit instead. So, um, what uh, is, uh, you know, going to be done now, basically, is um, they're doing now is they're, they're saying that skulks, bundles and torches are now going to be 1.18 and not 1.60. 1.17, not 1.16. Sorry. Have I been have I been saying 1.18 instead of 1.17? I hope not. I can't remember. Anyway, um, now again, skulks. I, I, you know, I didn't even think they were going to be in 1.16 from the start. So it's just like, yeah, sure. Um, they should just be added in with the warden. Um, but apparently they're going to be one delayed till 1.17. But the warden isn't even coming in 1.17, it's coming in a later date that has been unconfirmed at this point in time. But bundles and candles, like I thought bundles were pretty much perfect as they were, you know, um, basically being able to hold up to 64 of any of, you know, any combination of items. And I thought, okay, that's going to be really good for, like, farms and stuff. If, um, you know, you can put, like, potions and um, uh, armor and tools and weapons in there. Um, you know, basically, it'll just, like, make it easy to store all of that stuff. Um, if you want to store a large amount of bows for whatever reason or whatever. Or potions. You know, if you have, like, a witch farm or a... A skeleton spawner, or uh, or something like that. Um, so yeah, there's that. But um, uh, other than that, uh, also I would really like it if they added the uh, mechanic where if it was in the chest and then the hopper was pumping items into that chest, and it, it you know the bundle was in the first available slot, then um, all of the items that would have been put into the chest would just go straight into the bundle. Now that would be really cool because then you could just fill up an entire uh, double chest with bundles and then um, the hoppers would just fill up all of the bundles with like, uh, you know, potions and 
bows and stuff like that from you know skeleton farms and witch farms and you know all the different farms um i don't know if they'll add that or if they were gonna add that or what's going on with that but i don't know um and the candles that to me they seem like they were pretty much perfect like uh, there's no, there's nothing in my mind that they could do to change up candles that would make them any better, really. Um, so it's just like, but they've delayed them to 1.17 caves and cliffs, and it's just like, why? And it's just like, oh, it's not, their their excuse was basically was, oh, it's not to our uh, stand, qu standard quality, and it's like, nobody looked at candles and bullets like. I can't believe Mojang put them in the game in this state. They're completely unusable. How could Mojang think this would be a good idea at all? Like this, they better not make it into the main game in this state. Otherwise, I'm gonna uh, start a hashtag cancel Mojang. Yeah. Like nobody was, nobody was saying anything close. There was just like. So why were they delayed? Like, like, honestly, in my opinion, it's just Mojang just not having respect for their player base again. They've done it with not wanting to say they delayed Caves and Cliffs and just saying, oh, we've split into two parts. We're not delaying it. We're just splitting it into two parts when they're not even really doing that. They're just giving us a small handful of features which is even smaller now. That would have that would have just been in been in caves and cliffs. Like, um, and yeah, if you just ask me, this is just them bullshitting again. Like again, like I said, with the whole caves and thing, you know, it's just like, um, they was like, mm, we really want these to be in caves and cliffs. We really have no reason to uh, take them out of 1.16, even the, even, especially since we've said they'd be in 1.16. But we're gonna do it anyway. And we're just gonna say, ah, it's not up to our quality stand. It's like, I fucking bet, it bet, like, I'm not, I'm probably not gonna follow up on this, but I bet that it, that um, in, 1.18 caves and cliffs when that comes around and the candles and bundles that are put into the game They're gonna be pretty much the same like maybe a minor Texture update like a slight change to that but there's no, they're not gonna make any major cha major changes to bundles or candles um, Like skulls will probably get a bigger change because they did sort of feel a bit half finished um, but bundles and candles, they're just going to come back exactly as ha how they are right now. Seriously. They're not going to change. They And it's just like, they just wanted to be, I, I bet they just wanted to be in caves and cliffs for what? Whatever reason is like, we want these to be in caves and cliffs, even though we've basically confirmed they were going to be in. Uh, 1.16, we're delaying them for no reason. I'm just going to say that it's what they do, just don't make out quality. And it's like, I get, I guess some YouTubers don't really want to get on Mojang's bad side, but they're just, they're, they're all just like, yeah, sure, whatever. Like, so, like, um, some of them was like, oh, don't know what. Like, they're, they're sort of like soft hinted at. So, like they they kind of agree like there's like oh I don't know what they'll be changing but you know, they're just like it, even like the YouTubers that don't really want to get on Mojang's bad side they're just like no, I don't know and it's just like come on guys like after, like I could I could like somewhat understand that them being a bit more soft on them basically disrespecting their fans with the whole Splitting it into two parts when they're basically not even doing that. They're basically just delaying it like it's like, okay I guess you don't want to give them some uh, Bad feedback for delaying a game because then that might um, Make them more more hesitant to, to delay the update um, in the future um, Which we don't want but um, 
there, there is no good excuse for this, really. Like, just call it as you see it, guys. Just be like, yeah, I know this is bullshit. There's no reason for these to be delayed. Like, what, what are they going to change about the cancels? Like, if you, uh, we want it, we want to make it sure that if you, uh, place the candles, uh, in a star shape with redstone connecting the dots, then you'll be able to summon Hera Bright. Like, no, they're not going to do anything like that. Like, seriously, they're not going to change. So, honestly, I don't know why they didn't, didn't just leave them in 1.16. Like, nobody would have complained, but it's just like, They've just opened themselves up to just like real critic like criticism of that. It's just like no. There's no reason to delay them. They're perfectly fine as they are. So why are you bullshitting us saying that they that they need to be delayed because you know they're not done they they're, they're, I don't know. Anyway, what do you think? Do you know something about bundles and cancels? I don't know that might um explain why they're being delayed. Do you think YouTubers should be a bit more ballsy with calling out uh, Mojang when, uh, you know, they're just feeding us bullshit like this? Or do you think I'm being too harsh on Mojang and they're just trying to give us the best update uh, that they can? Um, mind you, to be honest, I would have preferred it if they didn't eat, if they just delayed Cave and Cliffs entirely and you know didn't even bother with this whole half-assed um splitting into two updates where which we're not even doing is again you can one half-assed mini update and another three quarters asked update um but i, I honestly would have preferred something close to like buzzy bees where they just like okay let um, we're not going to be able to get Caves and Cliffs out in time, so let's just make a little feature that will add, uh, you know, for the summer update, you know, just to hold them over, like, um, uh, I don't know, what's something, um, people that would be, have asked for for a while that would go in, I don't know, um, maybe a new pet, like, um, uh, I don't know. What was the coin pair that I could add in? Um, well, or maybe just like update, you know, existing pets. It's like update dogs. It's like uh, doggo update. And then it's like add like more skin, a wide, wide variety of different types of dogs. Maybe even have them and maybe like change of how they spawn. So like you can get only get like certain t species of dogs in certain environments. Like if you go to a snowy biome, you could get husky. Like People would lose their fucking minds if you did that. And it would just like require very minimal coding. Because it's just like, okay, take the dog model, make it look like a husky, and have it only spawn in cold biomes. Like, people would fucking eat that shit up, man. Like, seriously. Hashtag give us the husky update. Or, seriously, just like. Uh, all just, and like she, she be people lose their minds if you added Shiba Inu, 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 Shiba Inu to the game. Like honestly, just they could have just done a small update, completely separate from Caves and Cliffs and what we got so far. Just like something small like that that fans would have liked, and people would have been fine. Just like okay, Caves and Cliffs is update is delayed, but we get more doggos. I love doggos. Give me more doggos, please. Um, or maybe make it so that you can craft doggo armor, because why not? And then just like have them wear the, wear the little armor and they'd be, and it would be fucking adorable. Like, come on, guy, like, come on, guy. It's just like do hashtag doggo update. Uh, anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.